Hi everyone, in today's video, we will fix the Google Pixel phone power button not working. So to fix this problem, you can follow this step. Step 1 is to simple do a soft reset. So to perform a soft reset, you can simple press the power button and keep holding it for up to 30 seconds. Okay, and then after your device will be restart. You will see the Google logo on the screen. And if the button is completely unresponsive, connect the phone to a charger for 15 to 30 minutes. Then after try the step again. The next step is to you can simple check for software related fixes. Firstly, you can boot your device into a safe mode. Third party apps can interfere with button functionality. To do, you can simple power of your device. Sorry, you can long press the power button. Or you can open the control center. And then after press the power option. And then long press on restart. And then you have an option to reboot to a safe mode. Then simple tap on OK to reboot. After that, you can once the, your device will be booted into a safe mode, you can check that your device is working properly or not. If your device is working properly in boot mode, it means the third party apps causing the problem. And if not, it means the issue is from your software or hardware end. So once your device is turns on into a safe mode, here you can follow this step that I told. After that, you can check for update. A box in the current Android version may affect the button functionality. To do, you can open the settings. Go to system setting. After that, go to software update. Now click on system update. After that, it will check for new version. So, firstly connect to a Wi-Fi network to check. Enter the password. And once the new update will be found here, you can simply download it. Okay, then after do a soft reset. Sorry, restart. The next step, next step, you can simple clear the storage. So to clearing the storage, you can go back. Now go to storage. Then after you can here delete the bin as well as remove the unwanted files, photos and data. Okay. And the last, at last resort, you can simple factory reset your device. To factory reset, you can go to system settings, scroll down, then click on reset options. Again, click on erase all data. And then after, click on erase. So these are the steps that can help you to fix this problem. Goodbye.